how to cut out hairs in Photoshop 2024. Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel Design Dynamo. Today I'm going to show you how to cut out hairs in Photoshop 2024. This can be a tricky task but with the right techniques you can achieve a perfect result. So let's dive right in. Now guys let's get started. First open your image in Photoshop. Today we will be working with this photo of a model with long flowing hair. This image I downloaded from adobestock.com. So first we're just going to make a selection of here or the subject. So you can select your subject. You can use any technique to select your subject. So here I'm going to select subject from here. So I'm going to click here in the contextual taskbar. This AI power tool is a great starting point. So simply I'm just going to select this subject in the contextual taskbar. So Photoshop will automatically generate a pretty good selection of your main subject, including the hair. Look at this guys. And now let's refine our selection. So here I'm just going to click on select and mask. So you'll find select and mask a different method. So you go to select and here you just find select and mask and the short key is here on a max and here it is so you just see this workspace is open which is select and mask workspace so you can use different method to select your subject let me show you again the other method so how you can select your subject i'm going to click cancel from here and just deselect this selection command d this is the one method you select your subject the other method is also very simple you can select any selection tool like object selection tool so you can select your subject from this manner and you can use quick selection tool and go to select and mask workspace it will open here and you can further cut out here or remove your subject from here as well i'm going to cancel it and show you another method so go to select and here you will directly select the select and mask workspace and here it is in this you will see this select and mask workspace is open i'm going to change the view mode here you will see the view mode so you can change the view mode on layers so you can see the effect of your change perfectly on a real time so you can do this from the right panel here you can see the right side of the panel view mode and here i'm going to select uh, overlay mode or you can select onion skin mode and go to select subject and you'll see it's automatically select our subject look at this guys and how perfectly remove the background with the help of select subject option so after that further refine our hair or image so so this option is a very game changer in photoshop for hair selections so first you, you see here the refine here option so click it to so photoshop will analyze the strands and edges giving you a much cleaner cutout so let's final touches so with your hair selections looking good here are some final selections so here you will see in the right side panel so by default here object aware algorithm here you'll see object aware algorithm so object aware is best for selecting years or for on complex backgrounds so you can use color aware so and the color aware is best for contrasting backgrounds so you can use select any options object aware or color aware which is work better for your image so here i'm going to select color aware and downside here for further final touches to refine our edges so here you're just going to check it out further view modes like overlay i'm going to select overlay and here you can change the color of the overlay different colors so check your selections here selections so downside here you will see you further zoom in your image to check out where is the rest background so you can further refine your here's with the help of a refine edge brush tool so here you'll see refine edge brush tool so click this and paint over 
your hair you can increase the brush size by clicking bracket key you can use this refine edge brush tool on the edges and where you want to remove background a little gray background here and after that here go to right side in the output setting you'll see decontaminate colors option so click this box and here you will see the result this option helps remove color bleeding around the edges of your hair so use it to avoid losing details so this one is the setting and here you will see the result which is much better and how quickly you remove the background of hairs cut out hairs from any image so any background and depend upon so simply here you just going to select the output setting here i'm going to select new layer with the with layer mask and hit ok and here just go to layer panel you'll see a new layer is created with mask so you can change it further so let's create a background so here i also download some image from adobe stock so just copy and paste this image and just drag it down and let's fill this background make a selection and go to generative fill and simply hit generate here it is this one before and after look at this guys or you can use any in uh, any background like gradients any picture you can change or you can generate any background by using generative ai so now guys let's check it out other example how to cut out hairs and this image is you'll see this curly here so there's a complex hair selection so now latest version of photoshop with the help of artificial intelligence make it very easy to select your hairs remove anything create a background so let's select our subject so here in this case first we're just going to create a background you can create any background or in this case i'm just going to create any gradient layer so go to layers and here i'm just going to select a gradient and any gradient just click hit here and here i'm going to select some preset build and presets available here so just drag it down make it layers and duplicate our image layer command j and drop it down and select our duplicate layer and after that i'll just go to select and i'm going to select and mask workspace and here you'll see select our subject and look at this guys how perfectly select our subject and here i'm just going to focus hairs in this whole tutorial so we are not talking about the selections all that so it is perfectly fine so we're just going to select refine here and that's perfectly refine our hair you'll see for further fine tune here i'm going to select a refine edge brush tool a little bit paint over this edges you'll see guys i think that's perfectly fine further refine our selection you just go to output setting and here decontaminate colors so here you you can use this option to remove color bleedings and look at this guys after clicking here you just check how color bleeding around the edges of your hair so it's avoid losing details and it is much better result and i think we don't need any further refinement so just select output setting new layer with layer mask and hit ok and look at this guys how perfectly remove with your hairs by using select and mask technology the ai powered technology as a great starting point to remove your hairs so let's play with your background so you can change any background color like this gradient so I'm just going to change this gradient to different colors like this. And look at this guys. You can use any method to remove your hairs. Or, but this method is perfectly good. And it is how it is easily you can remove hairs from your background. So this is all about how to remove or cut out hairs in Photoshop. I hope you like this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe and share my videos. Thanks for watching Design Dynamo.